Hello, everyone. Am I audible? Yes. Good evening. Yes, sir. Good evening. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so this is Rahul Gupta, and we have open session for week seven. We can start with the questions. Whoever has a question, please raise your hand. Actually, it's better if you once explain one matrix. <laughs> yes, <Again>. sir. <laughs> yes, sir. We are unable to understand what's going on in the matrix. After going okay. through the four videos, I'm not able to understand. And sir, please also okay. um, uh, explain the clique and uh, ages uh, size counting on the okay. size of ages. Uh, size of ages. If possible, sir. A theory part is somewhat okay, but pseudo code is uh, unable to understand. If some two by two matrix is given, how the pseudo code will be computed step by step, that is not able to understand. Okay, just give me a second. I think today I will need more pad then. Sure. Hello, am I audible? Yes, yes you are. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, I hope you can see my whiteboard. Uh, please start the YouTube stream. Uh, can you see my notepad? Yes, sir. Yes. Okay, so what the situation here is, we are trying to do something in bulk level, okay? Not just a small thing. And every, uh, oh, do you know what is the power in computational thing? That whatever we do in a small scale, if we apply the same method, we can use those to do the bulk thing, a very big, which we cannot do by hand. I mean, you can, but you can understand that why am I using cannot word, okay? So for a very specific question, let's say, uh, there are three customers, Rahul, Omkar, and Nikita, okay. Okay. So, hello, am I audible? Yes, yes, sir. sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What my uh, what matrix does? I mean, matrix is related to graph for our course. So, what is happening here? I'm saying two customers are actually same if they go in a shopping mall and they buy at least two or three items in the same category okay for example there are two students and uh, whenever they go they they buy maggie some biscuits some uh, milk uh, milk is very rare for students and uh, uh, chips snacks that's all they buy okay so these are the category of the packed food and in that case, uh, they have a similarity that they uh, buy at least two or more than two uh, it, uh, item category whenever they go to the shopping mall. So suppose there is a, so how will I represent it in the uh, picture, pictorial way? So I'm saying if there is an edge between two customers, okay, then it means they are similar in some way. For example, if I, I go to the shopping mall, I buy Maggie. Uh, Maggie is so common for students. Now we always use Maggie in every example. And uh, rice, okay? So 
and uh, uh, nail cutter. Okay. So this is not something we have, which I buy always, but okay. So this is a uh, category of packed food. Okay. This is category of packed food and this is uh, food and this is something accessories. Okay. Which is now uh, what Omkar does, he bought some biscuits. Uh, bananas so, and uh, hankies and okay something else um, toothpaste okay. ah, toothpaste okay. thank you this is so difficult for me. And Nikita has bought uh, uh, hair band. Hair band. <laughs> okay. And uh, bangles. Bangles. Oh. Wheat floor. <laughs> Does that mean she is a girl? She will buy these things only. Wheat okay. floor. Oh, wheat floor. Okay. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I'm and not getting actually. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. so, uh, okay, oil. So, so uh, these two category actually matches with Raul, correct? So that's why there is a, there is an edge between them. Okay, but uh, she did not buy any. Uh, so she has uh, accessories. Uh, is where will it come? The uh, hair bands in coming uh, accessories, let's say hair bands and bangles accessories. Okay, so this is food. So, uh, I uh, Rahul and Nikita also has a similarity, and Omkar and uh, uh, do they have so food is there? A uh, banana comes into food, handkerchief comes into accessories. Okay, so they also have. Uh, one and actually there is nothing which will uh, where we need a row I mean arrow so this is a simple as okay now how will I represent this in matrix is that uh, uh, do you understand what graphs mean here yes sir. yeah yes, graph part so is clear clear matrix okay so matrix. if there ha huh. so if there is a an age between two people then there is some relation. That's what we are trying to tell. Uh, the same thing you have studied in the maths week one. If you remember uh, relations, yes, so yes. Yes, sir. Rahul and R1 and Nikita are uh, related to uh, with R1. And then similarly, Omkar and Nikita also uh, have in relation and uh, so uh, uh, this is something which I uh, which we are saying to represent in the graph. Now uh, this pictorial way is very good in seeing and visualizing. But what if I try to explain these things in a, compet a computational language? Computational language means how will you express this thing in computer? Okay. How will you tell computer to do something? You cannot write, oh, Rahul and Nikita has an S, Omkar and Rahul has an S, and Omkar and Nikita has an S, okay? So what will we do? We are saying that, let's take a table, and table is not like table, it's a matrix kind of, where Rahul, Omkar, and Nikita are arranged as a header, And same people are here also. Rahul, Omkar, and Nikita. Okay. Okay. So, in our course, what we are trying to tell you that Rahul and Rahul are not in any relationship. So, zero. Okay. So, we are trying to say zero as a no. You understand? Yes, sir. Yes, 
what zero yes, means no yes, there is no relation and okay. one one for them okay similarly one zero one zero zero uh, uh, sorry one one zero and suppose if they don't have relation rahul and nikita then what will happen similarly i'll make uh i'll make rahul as uh, rahul doesn't have any relation with nikita so zero and this zero okay now this is another uh, this is one way of expressing fine okay good sir so till, till till now clear yes till now it is clear yes but see i am writing something which is very lengthy rahul omkar nikita sandhya these are not something which could be iteratable for this purpose you have to use list correct yes sir Yes. yes. To iterate yes. from Rahul to uh, Omkar to Nikita, you need a list. Yes. So we are human being and we have brains. Okay. Yes. So what I will say, let's assign something to everyone, which is unique. Which is unique. So let's zero is assigned to Rahul. Z one is assigned to Omkar and uh, two is assigned to Nikita. So by then, here we are starting with zero, zero only. Why not good. with one? Um, um, what should I say? I uh, this know. is this is something which we are uh, most of the uh, convention. That is yeah, that is okay, but uh, uh, that is the convention Binary. because uh, can I explain? Ah, uh, okay. So this is convention, okay. But standard thing that whenever you follow a programming language, which you will do after this computer thing, okay? Okay. Always starts with zero. Always start with zero because there is a logic behind them. Arif. So, so whenever you are trying to something right, okay. When you are trying to see the length or range, you don't need to think about plus one. Yes. Yeah. So you will understand this thing, but for example, just understand that because zero is a, a convention, it is being followed in most of the languages. Okay. Okay. So that's why zero. Otherwise, there okay. is nothing uh, special in that. Actually, we can go with the uh, one index rule. We can also start with one, but in the long run, you will find that zero will be more convenient for you. Okay. Till now, is clear. Yes, sir. So yes. what will I do? I'll do that uh, thing zero one two zero one two. Um, my handwriting is quite good, so don't worry about that. So one zero one zero one zero one zero. Okay. Now. So, uh, this is one way of representing, or uh, one thing which we can represent. And there is a one other thing. Okay, suppose there is a relation which is not by relative. By relative means here Rahul and Nikita were related, so Nikita and Rahul were related. Rahul Omkar were related, so Omkar Rahul were related, and Omkar Nikita were related, so Nikita Rahul Omkar were related. Okay. What if there is a uh, excuse me, directed? Yes. So, will you please explain what's uh, happening in this session right now? Because we are I'm... trying to summarize whole week seven. Okay, 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 sir. So, in this case, if I ask, uh, so this is a matrix, suppose M, okay, and I can access this as a I and this as a Z, okay. Okay. So when i equal to zero and j equal to zero, m on v axis like this, okay, is zero. Okay. So m one zero is one. Uh, second row, first column. First. One okay. one zero. It's one. What about m zero one? M one, one zero is one, is one. is one na. M one zero. 
M one M one zero is one na. Second column. Yes ma'am. M one zero is one. First row, second row. So first you have to go zero row. Okay. No, no. She was doing the previous one. Previous one. Yeah. Okay. M one is zero row. One. What you wrote earlier? The second one. After M zero zero, we wrote the second one M one zero. Okay. One zero is one. This one. One is one. And zero is this. So this is Then, one. Yeah. So this I one. one. Correct. M I yeah 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 yeah. Convention. Ah yeah. uh, yes. Yes. Now it is correct. Clear. Okay, and if I take non-direction, uh, then it should be uh, earlier. What was there? One, sorry. Uh, let me come to that point one. Okay. So in this case, what is happening? If you take any i or j, so m i j is equal to m j i. Is that right? Yes, sir. Yes. So sir. this is called the uh, non-directed. In 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 world, in graphical world, we say non-directed or undirected graph because there is no direction. Okay. 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 And the way we represent this in the graph in the matrix, it's, this matrix is called adjacency matrix. Okay. Adjacency yeah. matrix. Okay. The spelling is wrong. Can someone tell? Adjacent. Adjacency. Adjacency. Okay. C A N C. Uh, adjacency. Yeah. A C. So can you please explain okay. once more what is adjacency matrix? Okay. All, Actually, all. I think this word is not mentioned in our lectures, right? It is. It is mentioned. Uh, you have to see properly. I missed it then. No, even I missed it. Oh, seriously? Even I. We all are missed then. Yeah. Okay, then then, then uh, it is it is in question. So please listen carefully. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So so we are trying to make something which is pictorial in the numerical. Is that right? Okay. Or in yes, the sir. written thing. Yes sir. Okay. What we do in the algebra, we there is an equation x plus uh, y equal to five. This is a straight line equation, correct? Okay. Yes. This is algebraical form of the line. Right. Uh, uh, plus five and plus five means this one, correct? Okay. Yes. So this is this is a pictorial representation. This is the algebraic expression. Okay. So we tried a picture to convert into something which is written, correct? Okay. 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 And okay. same thing we are trying to just. I, I uh, it's quite messy now. So let's delete this thing. Here, what we are trying to do? We are trying to represent a a picture in a matrix, which is a written okay. form. Okay. Okay. And when there is a edge between two. We will call it as a one. Okay. So zero is assigned to Rahul. One is assigned to Omka. Uh, two is assigned to Nikta. Zero, one, two. Correct. Okay. Now, yes, understood, sir. As I as I can see here, there is a edge between Rahul and Omka. So zero, zero always will be zero. And don't uh, take it very. Uh, I mean, like line of what we say stone. Uh, it will change in whenever we do some processing. But in the initial, so when we start something, it is zero. When we are trying to represent a graph into the matrix, then it is zero. Okay. So zero one is what? Zero one is what? Rahul with Omkar one, and Rahul yes, Nikita one. zero. <clears throat> Rahul Omkar with uh, zero means Rahul. It's one. one. Omkar. Uh, by himself, it will be zero and one, and uh, for Nikita, oh, uh, I guess zero, zero, and one and zero. Correct. Uh, 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 so this yes, we sir. are putting here like one zero. Is yeah. There, is, yes. Yes. How are you getting this zero one? So why one a, one is zero? One one two two. Why it is zero? One, yes. One? Okay. By so, himself. By himself. Why, why it is zero? <laughs> Uh, just But how convention. do we get this? Yes, there is many questions. Yes, that's the okay, question. Okay, okay. So because I am representing this graph in the matrix. Okay, this graph which I have created here. Okay, if, if you yes. can't see, I'll I'll have to create again oh, in the proper manner. So uh, I, I mean, taking... Omkar with himself will be in relation, right? He is himself. Ah, why? Yes, 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 yes. 
why are we writing zero for that yeah ha ha so there is a reason for that um um uh this is in is that again a convention or... sir or it's just the convention just the convention okay uh okay. when you go to okay. uh, when you i uh, study week 10 in mathematics okay okay so there is a convention like uh, uh mainly um, we use graph for relation network and up, uh, approaching things so, okay so r r it will always be one okay by itself will always be one but just for your convention that uh, uh there is not that particular reason from others we have used zero and zero is used everywhere sometimes it is used as a infinite okay in uh, in other courses so don't take uh, at uh, i mean don't go in deep uh, about this just remember that when we convert a graph in adjacency matrix 0 0 is 0 1 1 is 0 and 2 2 is 0 so that diagonal element is always 0 okay? okay 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 sir now okay so what two convention we told that we are yes, starting sir. from 0 you can start from one also there is no problem uh, absolutely no problem but for this course you will face problem so you have to start from 0 okay second thing uh, any ij we always access the element so this element is what i a throw zero uh, throw and zero th column column so this is zero zero okay hmm. so whenever if i represent it i from i with a j variable there are two variable which will be used in iteration is always zero because i is equal to j is that fine okay can you okay, please repeat sir. Yeah, sir. Oh, I see. Yes, sir. Got it, sir. So you got understand? It. We will go through uh, through iteration from. Can here you please to here. repeat once? Can this I am J equals to zero. Okay. Ah, uh, that's what I'm doing, Sandhya. Ah, uh, in iteration, what Sorry. you will have to do from year to year, okay? Year to year, and from year to year, okay? So to access any element, you need two things: column number and row number. Row number. Okay. Yes, sir. so first we are what we are putting this is also another convention that we are using row first yes you could okay. you could argue that why okay. but but just a convention that uh, we are using row first okay hmm. so in row uh, uh, first we are using row then we always say, so what is the index for this what is the uh, one one Which okay, I equals to I is uh, okay, I is equal to J. I is one. So row equal to one. Yeah. Row is yeah. one, and column is column is one. So yeah. I can say M row column. Okay. Column. Yeah. So this is variable. When we are searching in three D. Uh, in this course there is no three D. Okay. Okay. How did we get uh, zero, sir? Over there. Over there. With one and one row and column are one and one. You just we should take it as a thumb rule as of now. We should. It is just like uh, it is just like a, ah. we are making a uh, pair. Okay, one to one is uh, suppose we make a difference in it. If we get a difference, we say one. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, so you're we, doing one minus one have... is equal to zero. Yeah, no, both no, 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 I and J it, are equal. It. Then you if have if to take zero. It it it's. it can be just like uh, if we are taking it in a different uh, different question like uh, if we are taking both side subject okay so we are comparing if we are comparing both subjects like uh, uh, if you are comparing com chemistry to chemistry mm. then then it must be zero okay uh, if we are taking maths to maths then it must be zero because we are comparing with uh, ourselves but there will be a relation no yes madam yeah i i don't understand that but it is still a convention uh, for example you can also take it as one but yeah. you should know that when you access zero and zero i mean uh, if you say that uh, in the program if you handle zero comma uh, m zero zero and if it turns out to be one you should know that it is being compared with the same subject it is just a convention you can yeah. put either zero or one but you should know what to do when you access zero zero one one two two So it will be the similar number. 
yes you should know what to do that i mean what what to do when you when you get the... later in the program yeah you can okay, either so... put one zero whatever so in the case of one and two we are we are putting one uh one and two like it is uh, not compulsory but uh, it is yeah. just like we are making in diagonal elements see uh, zero 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 uh, are the di diagonal elements uh, the diagonal uh, elements are all zero yeah because yeah, yeah, uh, not yeah yeah go on please go on yeah just like uh, we are suppose we are making uh, uh, whatever we know suppose if we got true value then it must be one and if we got false value then uh, it will be zero. zero it is just on uh, so i i think so this is for example just yeah, like can I, maybe can, can i yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. suppose let's say that uh, you get uh, you are uh, processing this value zero you got an output zero and you want to know uh, which column i mean out of which column and row it has come from okay so in this matrix uh, zero are there in uh, when you get zero zero or zero two or it is one one or it is two zero or it is two two okay so these are the five places where you get zero okay Ye yes sir. okay so these are I the agree. only five places you get zero but mm -hmm. uh, previously yeah. even before you started the program you know that zero is going to occur in zero zero one one and two two okay so you now there are you have eliminated three possibilities among the five so the uh, left out ones are 20 and uh, two i'm sorry it is 20 uh, zero, zero two and 20 two, uh, two two zero. Two zero. yeah so these yeah. these are the only two elements that you what left across. out what yeah these what? are the left out ones no because even before you started you know that where zeros are going to occur because you put the values no Zero zero one one and two two. So it is okay. just a convention. I am trying to say that. So you can either put one or zero. But it will always know. be like this. Yeah, you can put one also, but you you know in prior where it is going to occur. Those ones or zeros. So it is which we created. Okay. Yes, yes, exactly. That's the point I wanted to convey. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So just like we started the list iteration from zero, mm -hmm. we are going to put uh, zero zero as zero, one zero as zero. I mean, it is just a convention. We are going like a binary side, I guess. Not binary exactly. Not binary. Some. Some. No. Yeah. No. You are saying convention. Yeah, it is a convention. I would say that. I would stick on to that convention. Yes. Okay, let's give uh, chance. Uh, Rahul, is Rahul is also, let him see. Also, <laughs> yeah. uh, 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 actually, uh, minutes before someone was uh, told that zero is for a uh, uh, true. I think she was saying uh, zero is not for false. Actually. Zero is false. One is true. Okay. Please yeah. read something. It's re going on notepad. Yeah. Try to read. Yeah. This is all what Sir said earlier. Okay, am I allowed to speak now? Yes, <laughs> yes, sir. yes sir. Okay. of course. Yes, please. So some, so some convention which we have taken where you have to be uh, following uh, all of that to solve the questions okay there are many reasons uh, which says that i equal to m i j equal to 0 if i equal to 0 and the question is why that could be explained in other uh, ways but for starting i want you to just say that this is a convention okay yes sir uh, to just explain you in the simple way suppose there are uh, three uh, um, members and a is good in something which who can teach b okay hmm. so this is this is because i am using arrow means a can teach b not b can a okay arrow Understand. means that this is a directed okay yes sir yes. and b can teach c so if m of a b should be 1 or 0 
bigger thing in a simple manner yeah and to make something yeah. simple you need to go one by yeah. one and that is called iteration that's why to iterate the vertices of the matrix you if you say, i will say that go from a to b b to c you need a list okay if you have 200 vertices correct yes sir you cannot name it like that and if you name it you cannot access it in in a that easier manner you just need to remember first okay but yes sir but numbers are very magical if you start from i equal to 1 you can access i i equal to 2 by i equal to i plus 1 okay yes sir is that right yes sir yes. so conventional yes. that's why we convert every ss every vertices in a numerical form there is nothing need that is also another convention just mm. to make the things simpler yes sir uh, sir yes, sir. can you repeat the last part even the vertices are in numeric form even the vertices are in numeric form so if yes, i represent sir. this graph in the adjacency matrix form then i'll name a as 0 b as 1 and c as 2 okay as uh, the labels One. to the rows and the columns right Yes. Sir. Yeah. So and now I'll ask that what a uh, is a zero zero related? Zero. Again, this is the convention, and I'm writing zero. like this. Yes. Sir. Yes. Yes. Zero one one fine. One. One two zero. One. Zero. Zero two zero. Huh. One one. 
No, no, it is zero. zero. It is zero no, because it is no. directed graph. Because it is directed Haan. graph. Directed it, graph. Is, it, yes. it is zero. No, zero. Yeah. And one three one two one one three zero. One three. Zero. One three. Zero. Uh, it's one two, two. It's one two. One two. Okay. Okay. One two okay. one. It is zero. Zero. Zero zero. Zero one zero. So, yes, sir. Zero. Sir, can you explain why 0, 1, 0, 2 is 0, sir? Uh, 0, 2. Because A can uh, teach so C, this no? Is, so, this is 0 and this is uh, 2. Is sir. there any A's? No. Yes, sir, but A can teach C, no? Sir, 2, hmm. 1, 1. I don't know. If it is not in the graph, then A cannot teach in the test C. That is what we... Okay, something. Can control Z work here? Huh. Okay. So, uh, this is not connected, okay? We are not yes. making something different from graph. This is a replica of graph in the something, in something different manner. Okay. In something different representation, okay? Okay, so, so you cannot take implied meanings and all. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Got one it. thing you need to remember in the whole courses, okay? In the whole course, you one thing you need to remember that this is easy to visualize, correct? Yes, sir. Yes. This is yes. easy to write. Yes. 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 But you understand which which is more easier if you uh, do a processing by yourself, not right. by the computer. So, graph. so you just graph remember that. So always we will say there is a M which represents the graph G, but we will not give you anything M. What you need to understand that G, see the G and uh, take the decision. Okay. Okay, sir. Mm. Got it. Got it? Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Can you please explain upper matrix, right, lower matrix also once, please? Upper matrix uh, means... Why? Uh, those are very simple things. Why are you so worried? If they are zero and this is not zero, then uh, any element is not <coughs> zero, then this is upper matrix. That is normal. Every, uh, lower thing is uh, totally zero, then this is upper matrix, okay? Yes. So, uh, uh, other thing is the lower matrix. Means, when i, j, m, i, j is 0, if i is less than j, I mean, i is greater than, sorry. Greater than j means this part is the, where i is greater, okay? We have diagonal element, I have one. No. Below the diagonal elements element. are always zero. below the diagonal. The, below, below the, the diagonal, diagonal above the diagonal. That's it. So below the diagonal means below the diagonal in mathematical form tells that row number is greater than the column number. Column number. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, next thing, what will I tell you that I am take, going to take a problem. We will create a matrix, and that matrix I am not going to create. We will visualize that. Okay. Okay, sir. We will what we will do? We will visualize only. So I am taking a graph here which has. <coughs> um, let me take the next page then. Okay, so this is a graph, and I'm going to uh, say that A, uh, B, C. But you understood that what am I trying to say is everything will be numbered. Okay. So 0, 1, one two, two, 3, yeah. and 4. So this is City Delhi. This is Karnataka. Bangalore. And Jaipur. Chennai. So Jaipur, Jaipur and Chennai. Chennai. Okay, what am I trying to say you? If there are there is an S between two nodes. Nodes. Then there is a direct flight between those two cities. Don't tell Got me it. that there is a flight from Karnataka to Delhi. Got it. Okay. Please do not tell me. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Just for example, I'm taking like this. Okay. And I'm saying that this is bidirectional. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay. Now. What I'm trying to say, I'll create a matrix M, which is called, what is it is called? So this is graph G. 
adjacent symmetric this is graph g direct and this is matrix which is called the adjacent symmetric of g okay and we represent this as a okay hmm okay my thing is that i am trying to create a matrix from this graph 5 by 5 matrix so it will make yes. a 5 by 5 matrix is that right yes yes sir yes sir yes and i am trying to see that from where i can go uh my question is okay if i want to go from 0 to 3 can i go directly no no sir three, three. No. no no you have to go to 2 and 3 okay or 1 to 3 1 2 3 1 3 yes is that right m 0 2 equal to 0 is that right one no sir it no, is false sir. it is false it, is it one must is. be one it one must one be one one so i actually asked for 0 3 oh 0 3 is false correct false m 0 no, it sahi hai sahi hai m 1 2 0 so my first problem is going to tell that which are the two places sir m12 is 0 or 2 1 it must be 1 na why you wrote 2 in in one, result one, two, three, three. yeah 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 okay yes sir so one. so my question is we are trying to find those two what it says between them we need to take one third hmm okay what i am trying to say we are going to see two what it says between them either we can go directly or we need to take one third maximum okay okay sir so what i told if m to 3 i cannot go directly what will i try i'll try to go somewhere else what will i do i'll try to go somewhere else and the, those could be somewhere else means 1 2 3 3 i cannot go so 1 2 is that right yes, yes. but there is but no there yeah 2 to 3 we can go but we there is no uh, edges in between 2 uh, and 4 so we must have to go this path uh, like that is the to japan that is the later part okay that is the later part okay because in computation you don't see the graph yeah okay so in the the matrix will tell everything okay okay so in the matrix language i'll try to go somewhere where i have the direct flight which is 1 2 4 then i find that 1 and 2 has direct flight 3 doesn't a uh, 4 doesn't have okay okay sir okay. is that is that right yeah then i will iterate through this this subset 1 and 2 if one, from 1 2 3 is there a flight direct flight yes yes, yes. it is there is it then is i'll clear. say that the, if i buy, get at least one any one then i say oh m03 now and this is not m this is m2 or m1 you say this is another graph okay So, uh, so this so one. Yeah, what is the graph? difference between M and N one? Is it okay? Are you creating a new graph? Now my my next graph will be uh, next thing is that I am trying to find. So M is another clear. Another path. Everyone. Another path. Is it another path? No, no, no. Uh, let me just tell you. Is it the uh, implied graph that you are trying to draw? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. So one thing, tell me. Hmm. This. Graph and adjacency matrix is clear. Yes, sir. Clear. Yes. yes. Okay. Leave it. Uh, don't think about this. I'll go through by this way first. So okay. I'm trying to make a graph where I'm saying that either by one way or by either directly or taking one half, I'm able to reach between two vertices. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Same thing. Zero, two, three, four, one. Okay. Okay. Can I go from zero to one? Yes, so yes which is directly yes. i directly connect yes. connect them yes. is that fine yes, yes. we uh, the 
by the which are directly we will connect directly to them because i can go there is that fine yes sir yes what i am saying also connect those point those uh, nodes which have at least one halt okay Yes. Okay. 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 Okay, sir. okay, sir. So from zero, I need to go to three, but I cannot go directly. But I found that from zero, I can go to one, and then three. Yeah. Three. So yes. in the graphical way, I'll say that there is an edge between zero and three. Yeah. This graph means direct root. This graph means maximum one root, maximum one halt. Okay. Got it, sir. This was graph G. This was this is graph G one. Similarly, tell me what will happen if I go from zero to one. Mm -hmm. The three I I reached okay direct. from one, uh, zero to four I am not I don't have direct but I have a direct uh, in the zero uh, to two, two, two to four two zero to, to four zero, zero to four is also there. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Zero to and nothing else need to be can uh, calculated. By one from one, can I go to zero? Yes, sir. 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 Yes, So one to zero is not possible, correct? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But one thing is, uh, you need to care, be careful because when I am talking about one halt, actually I can go from zero to zero taking one halt. Okay. There, M one. If I represent this by a matrix, which is called M one, so zero zero is actually one, not zero. This is what I am was trying to tell you that this is not the. Initial matrix. This is the generated matrix. Sir, I didn't so, understand the last part from zero to zero. Yeah. Same. Why do you have to go from zero to two and then two two back to zero? Ha. Huh. So you have to go okay, from okay. zero to zero, taking one halt maximum. Oh, okay, so that okay. is possible. Okay. So we are saying so, now zero to zero is also the M zero zero is also one now. Just yes, like so, uh, two to three and three to two, right, sir? Yes, correct. So this is also becomes uh, so three, the two two also to becomes three, one three to and three also three becomes one. But one, yeah, still but you three. don't have four to four to four, four, four. to four. Yeah, one and to one three. is not also possible. Yeah, got it. So this you generated this G one from G. Similarly, from the matrix. Sir, can you repeat can generate, what 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 you just said? M zero zero one one or something. So in this graph, M zero zero one was zero uh, was zero, correct? Yes, is yes. that right? Yes. But I, when I converted this to M one, which is still trying to tell that you need to take maximum one halt, it is saying one. No, Because in I this graph, one. zero to zero to zero, I have. But yes. I M one one one, I still don't have. So it, it will be zeros. Okay. Yes, sir. Because it is connected yes, to one halt. Uh, yeah, it is bi-directional, right? Yeah, That's yeah. why zero to zero one, right? Yeah, it is connected only. to bi-directional. So even if possible. it is not bidirectional, even if it is not bidirectional, ma, there could be a structure like this also. Take take not any non-bidirectional graph, and uh, you will be seeing one other pattern, which is okay. You go to one, and yeah. uh, you cannot come in a one halt. It will be uh, more than one halt. Then you will get that. Okay. So if it is not uh, bidirectional, then in one halt you cannot come. Okay. So my question is that like what logic did I take? forward overall we can say that if the if the condition satisfies then one otherwise zero no 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 my question is what condition i take to create matrix m1 Ma one halt maximum one, so halt. one halt one halt and for one halt i try to see if m i to j one and m j to k is equal to also one then There is a one. Uh, there is a root from I to K taking one halt. Yes, sir. Got it. I got it. It is just like zero to one and uh, one to three, and we are saying 
zero to three is possible. Am I right, sir? Correct. It's so a transitive, transitive relation. Yeah, Jay transitive Bing. relation. Yeah. Transitive and, relation. Yeah, yeah. You are right. You are right. Transitive. Uh, someone told that transitional relation, huh? Transitive. Transitive relation. Transitive. Transitive relation. It's yeah. good memory that it is B core mathematics. Yes, sir. And yes, this sir. will be also will uh, you will run in uh, week eleven, week ten of mathematics. Do not worry. Sir, uh, this is only pairwise relationship, right, sir? Yes, pairwise. Can relationship. we can can there be triple relations like a combination of three elements, kind of? Uh, uh bro, uh, I will say that let's finish two and understand everything, whatever it is. Then we'll go to the three, huh? If you're good with it, will be more complicated in that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now come to the this part of them. Uh, my question. What was my question when I'm trying to do taking one halt? I compare two times. Okay. If okay, I am taking one one, I I want to go from I to J. Okay. Better to say I to J. I am trying to see that if there is a K where I can reach from I. And then from K I can reach there. Then M I equal to J. If earlier it is not connected, okay. okay so if sir. I am uh, J, but this matrix is different. This is not the adjacency matrix which we are talking about. Mm. This is a generated matrix from M, and my M was the adjacency matrix. So come to the pseudo code part. How will we do these things in pseudo code? Mm. Is this unidirection oh. and bidirection both are same? Uh, no. Non-direction, non-directed, undirected, undirected, and the bi. Yeah, no, non-directed. No, no. Undirected means undirected means bidirection, and actually, but the, yeah. when every is has two row, you don't need to say the error row thing. Okay, what I did say. Uh, because in like the video lecture, it's mentioned uh, undirected. Okay. Yeah. So, see, look, this is a uh, this is a bidirectional. Okay. Yes. Only these two part. So this is called directed. If any arrow is row used, that is directed. Okay. Because okay. only this part is bidirectional. If everything yeah. is, if everything is bidirectional, then you need to say that this is undirected. Actually, you don't need to put the arrow. Don't want to show the arrows. Uh -huh. So this is bi-direction and n-direction is same, okay? In uh, in a graphical manner. But bi-direction means both are connected and both are in a relationship. If two uh, any uh, any row has one unidirection, then this is a directed graph, not undirected graph, okay? Okay, okay. so I understood. Yeah. So the un okay. in undirected does not mean uh, not right. It means bi-directional. Hmm. Yes. All are by direction. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's take another uh, thing. Um, and now we will talk in the uh, language of computer, um, computational thinking, which is I again I will take zero, one, two, three. Okay. Abe tomatoer tha. Me gula tomatoer nahi hai. Bas. Ye to itna tomatoer. Bhai mere ghar bhi nahi hai tomatoer. <laughs> okay, so this is a graph which I am trying to tell you that uh, G, this graph is G, okay? Now I need to find the matrix which represents that we can reach from one in the one vertices to one vertex to other using one halt. Is that right? Is yes, my yes, question sir. clear? Yes. My question yes, is yes. my question is create a matrix which four plus four. Uh, represents uh, that uh, which represents for the matrix stuff. Uh, reaching <laughs> using one heart. Okay. Hey, please do not make mock huh? uh, This is a very precious time for the working professionals. They spend all day in the offices and come to this session. Okay. Don't uh, waste their time. Okay. 
now this is a question we we are we are supposed to make that first what we are trying to say uh we will create a we need to create yes, a okay excuse me single halt or uh, any number of halts sir uh using single halt thanks okay. using i was also like uh... are yaar ye to gadbad sa hai multiple na bekar hai ओके नीचे कर दीजिए एम इक्वल्स टू वन ऐसे लिख दीजिए रुको रुको यूजिंग मैक्सिमम वन हॉट ओके मैक्सिमम वन मींस जीरो हॉल्ट इज आल्सो पॉसिबल ओके दिस इज आल्सो कॉल्ड एट मोस्ट वन हॉल्ट एंड and if you remember i mean if you have seen the lectures you you will see one one hook yes sir okay oh that is the same okay now come first we will try to create the matrix m and the way we create matrix m is that m is the create matrix i if i remember properly then this is the a sequence calling matrix uh, matrix is a okay now n cross n what is it is like so a, we need to know we need to know what is n na? yeah it is number of uh, vertex number of nodes or vertex number of matrix or number of so if i say na n cross n so you need to understand first thing what is n n oh, is the column. number of vertices yeah okay uh oh, you need to understand what is the n n is the number of vertices okay but yeah. n is the number of vertices how many vertices four so this is vary from 0 to 3 is that right yes sir yes, yes sir so actually when i say this na this sequence means you take a matrix which has 0 1 2 3 okay and every element is zero in uh, initial position right sir so when i write whenever it is written create matrix n crosses okay okay so this okay. So this will vary from 0 to n minus 1 and every every entity every single entry is zero, zero. is that clear to everyone yeah yes. no yes sir okay initialization Like how how every element is zero. I mean, not clear for initialization. This is just the initialization which we were you were doing in the pseudo code earlier until week four. Okay, 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 okay. Then you started using empty dictionary, empty list. Okay. Then after you you started empty dictionary. Now this is zero. Okay. So here we are initializing. A matrix, uh, just a zero zero, right? So this is this is what this code tell. But what the adjacency matrix tell? That this is M and in M zero one is one, correct? Yes, sir. Mm. So understand the between initialization and the adjacency matrix hope this is clear to everyone yes sir so yes, we sir. are we are trying to create a matrix which shows this thing so what will i do i'll create a empty matrix which is m1 i i am trying to create m1 correct m1 means maximum one halt i am taking so i'll my first thing will be create matrix okay okay n cross n now if you remember i just told that if you need to reach from so create matrix is the something which i uh, which i told that will give 0 0 is that right yes sir yes sir yes it is so what will m1 first thing if i want to say that it has the all property of m because maximum or at most one alt means it can lead to directly 
from one nest to another okay yes sir so for each uh for each row rows for each row i in rows of m okay uh we are using this so then i am going to check from zero to every is that right yeah is there a, is there is any edge or not right sir yes yes so for each row yeah. i j column how we column. are going to use column okay column j j in calls of columns uh i don't remember if this is a sequence uh, we are following i don't think you need to say row i is sufficient yeah for I each i correct yes yes sir yes. okay yeah i answer i in row and j till c it is column yeah okay this is open with so ha huh. now whenever i see i and j we will make m1 equal to 0 is that right yes sir is that right or not yes sir it yes so actually the first we are trying to create the direct then one loop uh, one halt which is m1 i not j is equal to actually m i j is that right okay till now, non direction till now we got the direct direct so is that right yeah yes from from yes. here we will we will take another uh, same thing we will take and uh, do the uh, we will try to find the one halt way in column if now if m i j i k we are trying to take a k so where k get generated it is also the one of the number yeah k j then k j right sir m j m k j so i need to understand what is k so from i i'll try to see if one is there okay 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 uh, 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 listen from i we will try if there is a k where i can reach from i to k correct yes sir if this is one then i will try to find for each j in anything you can take because both are same in this manner we have taken uh, rows and column number same okay so whatever you say it will give a uh, same meaning okay uh better we say columns because we uh represent as uh, go from rows to columns so columns of m and uh, uh we open this bracket we did not close so first let's close this and we open this and now again one thing will check if j and k i have one so m of j k is equal to also equal to sign is wrong we should give the equality sign and if is equal to one what does it mean people got to understand if there is a s between i to k and if it is possible then i'll check from k okay if there is a h from k to j then it will say bhai saab make m1 m1 i to k equal to 1 is that right i guess you got understand if you don't please go okay, through the sir. code and let me know uh, go through the code i am giving 2 minutes to everyone just think whatever your question is we will discuss
got it sir good job you got it yeah got it Yes, this is what you guys missing in the lecture because in lecture Sugot is uh, Sugot is already created, so that could be the possible case you are revising sir, here. Uh, sir, uh, just can you explain uh, the code graphically? एक बार ग्राफ से सिर्फ बता दे बगल में कि वो क्या रहा एक्चुअली थोड़ा विजुअलाइज नहीं. Understand? So I want so, to reach uh, to the vertices from using maximum one halt. Okay. Is that fine? Okay. Yes. So Sir, in one... nine line, uh, M I J. M I J. Yeah. This. Okay. Um. What? Okay. Okay. Here I think. Hmm. Okay. Thanks, sir. So this should be K J, na? K J then I J. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So what am I trying to do? I'm going to I'm iterating through each vertex. Okay. Okay. I am choosing a vertex zero, so I equal to zero. Okay. And keeping the other vertexes in the suspension, iterating through others. This. Okay. Yes. Is that sir. right? <clears throat> so J equal to oh uh, sorry K equal to one is. uh if ik is equal to 1 ik equal to 1 then here k equal to 2 k equal to 3 are in suspension okay if from k i have a direct path to 1 2 or 3 so again i am using j which is varying from 1 to 3 again 0 1 to 3 0 1 2 3 So one zero does have any uh, uh, m zero one zero? Is it one or not? Is that confusing? Mm. I messed up. Okay. Okay. I equal to zero. I'm taking. Okay. I'm trying to reach from. I'm trying to see where I can reach from zero. Using maximum one halt, okay? Yes. Is that right? If if you can relate this pseudo code with the graph, then that's what I'm trying. Actually, uh, it would be great for to understand. Okay, so I am trying to see if I can reach from zero to one. Okay, so zero from zero, I am trying to reach. So zero to one is already there. Is fine? fine. Yes. From one, where I can reach? Two, two and three. Two and two. Two and three. Two. So from zero to two, I can reach in yeah. one halt. Okay. Yes. Yes. That is fine. Yes. That if I I am uh, reaching directly, but from one to three, I can reach directly. So it yes. means I yes. can reach here. So this is Not for zero. Is that right? But yes. Zero to three, we have a two halt, right? Zero to three, no? that is zero. Like we are going zero to one, then one to three. <coughs> so one halt, na? Huh? Okay. <coughs> From one, okay. From one, where can I reach? Two and three. Three. Three and two. From three, I where I can reach? Nowhere. 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 So so no extra addition for I equal to. I mean, from one there is no extra addition, correct? And then uh, from uh, two, two, no, no, yes, nowhere. So because I am not direct going anywhere, I cannot take one halt also. Is that right? Yes. Also, yes. So only one thing we will get extra, which is zero to three. This one only. This is what we are getting. So what I did, I iterate through a vertices. So that is I, okay. Okay. And then I try to find from where, uh, where I can go from I, which is zero. So I found that I can go to one. So I am taking from one to where I can go. 
three, so there is a root. From one to two, yeah, there is a root. Then from one to uh, uh, finish, then I'll take one as i. So see, first iteration with i, second where I tied for no one row, one direct root that was representing k, and from here to here when I was checking that was representing j. Sir. Yes, yes. From zero to one, we are moving zero to one. Can we move okay. two also? Yes, you. That's what you will do. Uh, okay. Let me do one thing. I'm remo removing two edges from this. Yes, so connected again. Okay. Um, let me take here. Okay. From uh, I'm removing two edges, okay. My cause my intention is to remove this, okay, and take this, okay. Go to one you are reaching, but from one you cannot go anywhere. So you'll come back to second iteration. So this was the first iteration, first loop. This is second loop. Sorry, I'm using the wrong one. Are paisa by samat karo. David. Okay, so this is the first thing, which is i. So i equal to zero. Now I'm going to find a k where I can reach from i. So I found i equal to one. Is that right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But from yes. one I cannot go anywhere. Yeah. So this condition is not being satisfied. This condition is being satisfied. But for when I am iterating this, I can. This is not being satisfied. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes. I go back yes, to this point. I go back to this point. K equal to one is done. K equal to two. Can I reach to two? Yes. Yeah. Yes, Again, J J will start from zero. Can I reach two to zero? No. No. Two to one. No. No. Two to three. Yes. When I get two to three, J equal to three. Then I say, "Bhai sir, isko bhi connect kar do. Connect these two. Yes. Yeah, zero to three. So once you finish this loop, you will go back to this loop. Then once you finish this loop, and you go back to this loop, then again come back. Till uh, how many iterations will happen in this? Can anyone tell me? And three. N. It is four, four, four. For every i, there will be four. And four. for every four, there can't will be we four. execute with four, two, two three? Loops? The same one. What? Can't we execute this with two loops only? Here we took three loops for each. So uh, from uh, two loops, you will directly find now which where are the direct roots. But here we took three for each. Three loops. So we are using one halt now. Okay. So uh, in the simple manner, what am I trying to do? This is Delhi. This is Kashmir. Uh, Kashmir upper hai. Kashmir. <laughs> okay, and this is Tamil Nadu. Okay, I know that Kashmir to Tamil Nadu there is no flight. Uh, don't take it seriously. Just uh, take it as a uh, situation. So what I am trying to find, I will go daily, daily to Tamil Nadu, and there is a Punjab. Okay, am I writing Punjab right? No, this is Bihar. Okay, so suppose. Uh, I am trying to uh, do a iteration. So first iteration will tell that uh, there is a Kashmir which will be I. Then I'll go find some K where from where I can go to Tamil Nadu. I went to Bihar. So J equal to one. Sorry, K equal to one. And I find that there there is no direct route. So I'll come come back to K equal to two. Okay, I find a root here, and then from two to three, this there is a root. So iterating this is another loop which is J. So that's why you need to know three loops. Need to use three loops. Okay, when, uh, okay. Understood. Ah, इतने में तो सर का कितना सारा लेक्चर करता हूँ जब आप लोग बहुत टाइम ले लिया okay anyway no problem thank you sir but acha hai bhaiya aapko clear ho gaya concept pura abhi yeah abhi abhi clear ho 
but if you see the lecture you could have finished at least two to three lecture but you guys did not see any lecture na no no, no, no. i have gone through all the four lectures all the lectures we watched i, I have seen lectures. four lectures no i i completed everything no, no, no. Uh, there so i have doubt uh, the code the, the code that you had uh, that you wrote uh, actually it's valid for max one or uh, max one uh, na means uh, for max one there is no code why are you uh, the iteration we were doing it was valid for max one uh, that is valid but mathematics will have much rigorous than uh, this Uh, in the semester uh, exam will be very easy, very easier for you because once you understand mathematics mathematics in mathematics na that is super clear thing to you Hello? then you will see what I say what did i study in computer science actually in the so lectures matrix was not computed 3 by 3 2 by 3 2 by 2 that matrix is not computed that's where uh, we struck to understand the so this am audible hello yes yes sir uh, can we do uh, the uh, direct uh, direct iteration direct graph can we make the direct graph like uh, 0 to 3 if you are making 0 to 3 mm -hmm. how how get this code in that so it will say that take i equal to 0 okay is that right yes sir then you will go up k k will vary from 0 1 2 2 3 is that right yes so k go, take k equal to 0 every node that it is connected or not ha ha yeah so connected will be Done from here only. So that is direct connection. This which is the adjacency matrix we are not creating anywhere. That we know. Can you please mute mute all ones? There is disturbance. There is some lag. Okay. So adjacency matrix we are not creating. That is understood for you. That M zero one is one because there is a an S from zero to one. Okay, and m zero three is zero because there is no s from zero to three. So we are creating this one. So what will happen? K equal to zero. Then i k means zero k is zero one zero uh, zero is one or not? No zero. No. No, so we will not enter into the whole block. Correct. Sir, second yes, row sir. is this correct? Second row columns or column that already become zero. Third loops, third oh. loops. Sorry. Third of third the loop. second loops are same. No, 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 not same. Sir, column could you continue in the progress that you were going in the same order that you were going? Just continue with what you had just started. Okay, okay, okay. So now I will take k equal to one. Correct. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Zero one is one or not? See the graph. Whenever you uh, yes, see sir. this now, you have to. Yes, sir. Five. It is. It is. Then I'll enter into the, in this block again. Now J is in columns. J will vary from zero to three. Okay. Yes, sir. Zero zero. Ah, uh, so K equal to one. So J equal to zero. So M K J means M zero zero is equal to one or not? See the graph again. Zero, one zero. Zero, that is zero. Zero. So I'll not enter into zero. Okay. Yes. I'll go to one. M one one. That is M also zero. One one. Zero. That is zero. One one is zero. Zero. M one two. One two zero. One two zero. One two zero. Okay. One, but yes. I mean yeah. one two zero. One two zero. No direction. Yeah. One three. No direction. One three. No direction. Zero. No. You finished the J J iteration. You will go back to K. Now K equal to two. Two. Come back to J. J is again zero to three. Okay. Okay. Two to zero. Two no to zero. No zero. sir. Zero. zero to two is possible. Two to zero is not. Okay. So we are working for two to zero, na? Okay. 
टू टू वन नो नो टू 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 वन वन टू टू जीरो जीरो टू टू जीरो टू टू थ्री इज पॉसिबल वन वन देन आई लेंटर इनटू दिस ब्लॉक ओके ओके आई लेंटर मेक एम वन टू एम वन दिस इज वाज आई सो जीरो एंड थ्री इक्वल टू वन इज दैट राइट यस सर यस सर Okay. Uh, J column fin. Uh, J iteration finished or not? Finished. Sir. Uh, Go back to K again. K equal to three. Three. So again J. Three to zero. Three, zero, three to one. Three to one. Three to two. Three to three. Z every Some, every value is zero. Yeah. Again I'll go go back to K. I'll go back to K. But I will see that K equal to three is done. Then I'll go back to I. No. I equal to. No. Uh, so One. that is very easy in saying graph. Now uh, you understood that the what uh, every pseudo code has a feeling. Okay, you need to understand that feeling only, the logic, not the. Uh, uh, even you don't need to iterate one by one. You need to understand. So I equal to one again. I'll go k equal to zero to three, and for every k, I'll go j equal to zero to three. Got is that it, right? Got it, sir. So whenever I'll find a middle value k, which is connecting i to k and k to j, I'll make j to i to j as a connection. That's what. Yes. 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 Sir. Sir, in graph it is. Sir, in your code in the second last line, this is if m j k right. J k j. Sorry, k j. K j. Yeah. K j. K j. Kj. It is uh, like a uh, transitive relation with this period, right? Okay. Yeah. If kj mm -hmm. equal to equal to one, one then, then m one i i j i j is equal to one. Okay, that's kj. Yeah. Yeah, that's kj. I did a mistake. I mean, there is no option going back in this code. I I don't know why, but in the uh, okay, if it is period, then I could have done better. Okay, no problem. You understood now? Yes, sir. Yes. Hope, uh, that is clear. Ba this is the uh, most basic thing in the graph. Okay. Now, what is there? We are in lecture seven now. Uh, week seven. And we are in nested dictionary. Okay. So dictionary part is very clear. Uh, you you might have understand the dictionary because every table could be represented as a Dictionary. So rather than using graph, you can use the dictionary also. For example, dictionary yes. Ah, uh, for you, where is notepad? You can say dictionary and matrix are same, no? Ah, uh, matrix and dictionary. There's a difference, no? We are learning. But you. If That's you, why we are using both. I mean. Yes. Uh, if you uh, go one by one, transition is different. Na? You uh, the way we access is different. Okay, so yes, how yes. will you create yes. this graph as a dictionary? So D is equal to you take zero and map it to the yes. list of items where it is connected, one and two. Okay. Connected is. Yes. So here one thing is the best thing that you don't need to access zero and three. You understand two. Iteration is getting reduced. Uh, one will be as an empty list. Uh, two will be three, and three is again empty list. Is that right? So this is yes, sir. Colon. So you will say for every done. for each each k in uh, i in. Keys of D, okay. So you, once you enter into the key, you go for each K. Ah, uh, for each K in this is a list, okay. You understand D of K. Ah, uh, see this I K J or is mixing. Let's take another case, okay. So this was one, two, three, zero. Okay, take this one, this one, this one, and make this one also. So D is here. What representing this graph as 
zero is connected to one, three. Is that right? One is connected to two, three. Two is connected to none, and three is connected to none. Okay. Now for each k, for each j, uh, we are starting with i. Sorry, i in keys of t. Okay. And uh, every for each k in d of i, if if m k uh, is uh, okay uh, what is that um, sorry because we already know that if it is written then there is a is then you need to find for each keys again in d and represent it as j if d j is equal to equal to k then m1 of i j will be 1 let me know how many of you understood the <laughs> third iterations for each how it is written what is your writing how how did i each... do just understand the line i uh, understand the logic i am use i am going no sir uh, third iteration okay. for each i cannot understand what they are writing yes sir you you uh... never uh, name, you never listen me that is the problem okay. listen na <laughs> i am saying for every outer loop i am trying to see how many of i mean see we, what are the one connection okay so whenever i am entering in i of k is d means zero so i will go for each k in d of i d of i is 1 and 3 correct 1 2 on 3 yes 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 sir so when k equal to 1 i'll again go to 1 here ah uh, 2 3 how many are connected so 2 3 so 2 3 2 3 is connected okay yes, from 1 2 3 is connected so for each keys in d uh each j in key of uh what was that <laughs> it uh, is this is one then that oh, sorry, sorry. Is, uh, yeah <clears throat> for each of uh, uh, j in d of one d of k sorry that d of k okay j in d of k okay d of k yes whatever it is there i'll uh, just make it clear okay no this will not be required even m i j so j2 so 0 2 will be connected <clears throat> j3 0 3 will be connected okay mm -hmm. understood or not no so we need to this uh, dictionary is mimicking the graph right from third uh, chapter please explain it again um third, for each third line third line wala. okay uh, notepad is visible yes sir. it is visible sir not uh, sir three. are we checking the same uh, that ha, same uh, problem are same we problem. checking the same uh, like common in zero key and one key uh, if there is any uh, similar elements in it then we make a pair of it Is Not it like that? The like zero uh, three, are... we have uh, and uh, one three we have, so we connect zero two three. No 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 no. <coughs> See, now it will Hello, be sir. writing doesn't. Yes. Hello, sir. First of all, for each i in the uh, key of d, that is mean zero. Then go huh? through for each k in d, that is one comes one. Then go for each k uh, in d of k. That is no element. Sir, yeah, will that, you please write? Will you please almost... write above that? Uh, what is i j k? Then it might be easy for us. 
the third line is written. Okay, Alison, my that one is visible one. <coughs> yes, it is. It is visible. Yes. So we are trying to understand how where we can reach from using one alt. Okay, maximum one alt. Is that fine? Yes. Yeah. yeah. It is. Okay. Uh, okay. Sir. So so what I will say. Uh, M sir, M one. Are you actually, writing on notepad? Yes. Uh, which is not visible. Whatever you are writing, oh. it is not visible. That's okay, what so I'm saying. Now it's visible. Now it's now it is visible. visible. Yeah, now it. But now my notepad is not visible. <laughs> is my notepad visible? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Now here it's visible. Then sir. share the you whole know? screen. A whole screen. I'm saying uh, sharing. Where is my whiteboard? So <laughs> <laughs> it's on the Zoom meeting, right? Yeah, we beside Zoom meeting, sir. Yes, no, it's yeah. all gone. Uh, share screen. Sir, can I'm sharing a screen? Okay. Uh, I cannot see the notepad. Notepad is here. not visible. Uh, notepad, Only you uh, can see. Notepad portal is visible. Yeah. Okay, we can start doing here only. Give me a second. I will make something very. I open quiz two. <laughs> yes. Okay, so this. Yes. This sir. One. This one point three is visual, lah. Yes, sir. It is. Now my notepad is also visual. This PDF and notepad both are visual. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. बहुत मेहनत कर रहा था यार ये. Okay. Now what I am trying to do is I uh, so. Uh, is it quiz two? You know. <laughs> okay, uh, it is, is. It is practice is finding you want, solution. We, you want to lose my job? <laughs> <laughs> of course not, sir. Okay, so from here I am doing what was the whole there? session is recorded. <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> listen. So this is. Uh, uh zero is connected to three Four and each. one okay and one is connected to two and three is that right yeah yes one is connected to three and two okay yeah and two is not connected to anywhere three is not connected and to three is also connected. not connected, not connected to anything so yeah. what am i doing i'm taking this d as a uh, i'm making it as a dictionary and from zero i am trying to check so m1 is like everything is zero except create matrix n cross n and first i need to see the direct root okay for each i in Is of D. Is that right? Yes, you understand? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. And every key has a dictionary. I mean list. Okay. Yes. So for each J in E of I. D is of that right? I. Yes. 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 It's clear. It is. Okay. Then. I, you know, if it is written, then there is a direct S. Is that right? So M one. Yes, sir. Uh, for each uh, J, M one is I and I, J will be one. I J equal to one. This is a simple one. This is simple one which I am trying to yes. say that zero yes, is connected sir. to one, or zero is connected to three. Okay. Yes, But sir. what one halt? If I talk about the one halt, then. Sir, is Again, this I, supposed to be is equal to one or equal equal to one? This is not the condition. 
Okay. And this okay. is a, I'm a signing a betting. You're a signing I'm a betting. one. I'm updating. Okay. Okay, okay. Zero is already there, na? Create matrix will tell that every uh, every element is zero. Yes. So we haven't Except... taken from matrix hmm. M. Okay. Yeah. No, I did not take from matrix M. I'm creating M. A, a fresh uh, matrix. From I'm scratch. taking everything from dictionary. Okay, from scratch. So uh, from dictionary, it looks like very easy, na? Yes, sir. <laughs> now, <laughs> what will you do? For each I in keys of D, if uh, for each J in D I, Now what will you do? You understood that there is a connection from zero to one. What do you want to know? Is there a connection from yes. one to something else? Yes, there is. That yes. Oh, for that yeah. you Two need to three. for you, that you need to access D one, correct? Yes, sir. yes, sir. Yes, sir. D D one is the value, and so that for each i each each uh, year we will use the second thing each k in D i. And I want to see that if D K is there, okay? So yes, I'll sir. I'll go for each. But yes, how sir. do you know K sir. represents the second key? I did not say in the second. Key. Every key has a dictionary, okay? Sorry, yes. every key is mapped to a list, yes, and so the yes, element yes. in the list are telling that these are the direct connections. Okay. And if we know the direct connection, then from there we are choosing that value as a key and checking where it is connected. Okay. So for each J in uh, D K, correct? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You need to make M I J S. M K. M I J S zero. Ah, uh, M I J S one. Okay, what it means? I'll show you here. It will say. थोड़ा सा छोटा करते हैं. Is that visible still? Yes, sir. It is. So if I equal to zero, say I equal to zero, <coughs> then K K will vary from D I, which is D I one and two. Is that right? Yes, sir. Yes. One comma three, correct? So yes, sir. For each K and D I, so yes. when K equal to one, you are going to check D K. D K means D one. Is K yeah. is connected? Yeah. Is K is connected to other value or not? Right, sir. Other value or not? Correct. So it yeah. will be actually D one is J. Okay. Yeah. And that is two and three. So okay. you will say that, yeah. bro, connect I to zero because I to one I can reach from one to three I can reach. Is that right? Yes, sir. yes, sir. Yes. Oh, uh, sorry. Zero to zero to one I can reach. Zero to three I can reach. But uh, zero to one is two. So zero to two I can reach. Okay. So M one uh, when I I is zero. I'll get J as two equal to one. Equal one. to one, yeah, yeah, it is clear. M, yeah, M zero three is already there, but if you update this, it will update correct uh, automatically update because this is always it is again repeating, but it will not change the value. It is again one, okay? Yes, sir. It, okay. Again for three, K equal to three. So you go to the like K D three. K is empty go list. To, huh. K is empty list. Why, boy? No, K is K one. K is the value of D I. D I is what? अरे यार कितनी बार रिपीट करा दो. D I is one and three. Is that right? Okay. Yes. So K will iterate through this. When K equal to one, then this will happen. J two three will be added to the. Sir, I'm saying M0. K K three. मतलब uh three does not have any other values. Okay, okay. So three is the empty this, list. This is Then, what I'm saying. Yeah, this is okay, what I'm saying. Okay, fine. So M, where M zero something will not connected. Everything will be zero else yeah. in yes, the row sir. zero zero row. Was it okay? So K value khatam. Then we will go to one. Correct. Okay, sir. So. And I will check from again D one and D one is two three. 
again i'll check d2 d2 is empty i'll go back d3 is empty go, okay, empty you all uh, go back then i'll check yeah. i equal to 2 i equal to 2 which is empty. already empty i'll go back i equal to 3 empty empty i'll empty. go back now over, over loop is over yeah so i uh, today i explain these things uh, sorry no i'm not cancel them right Today I explain that how to access the dictionary and how Sir, to go. Sir, uh, could you the... show the notepad again? The whole whole pseudo code again. Please? Sir, I have question. Could you show the pseudo code in one? Yeah, sir. What question? As sir? one from the beginning. Activity seven point one seven. Ah, uh, what someone was telling Divya? Yes, sir. If you could minimize this so that and you know so zoom out so that I. I can see the whole as one pseudo code. Yes, thank you. You are taking a screenshot. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are taking. Anyway, it's recording. Okay, no problem. You can But get it. But still, we can't two. see uh, the whole uh, video now. Okay. Uh, okay. Yes. Uh, if you find some mistake, then uh, uh, send me back, na. Okay, sir. Yes, sir. Sure. On Telegram. फॉर एग्जाम्पल देर इज अ uh there is a loop going on if you remember uh, do you guys visit uh, discourse forum and discuss on or, or not oh we 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 saw so we uh, saw earlier there is a confusion that why am i not able to see Okay, let me just. But don't know about the discourse. Okay, discussion forum is also there. No problem. Do so anyone know? Then remember. please let me know. Ah, uh, this is six point ten lecture which uh, Ajay was talking earlier in my. We won't get the access session. until next term. Uh, ah, uh, this so is that, still uh, quite. That pseudo code I did not remember what was that, but overlapping I told the concept. But the pseudo code has an error actually. Okay. Yes, uh, we discovered that yesterday. Ah, huh. so uh, Deepak, I think explained, na? Yes, Deepak. Yes, sir. Sir. yes sir. Make it public so that others can get benefited. It doesn't matter who has made a mistake. Mistake is mistake, okay? And others should not get affected by this. No problem. Okay, so I guess. Uh, basic of dicks uh, matrix is clear and i will suggest you help whole week so start going through the lectures sir i am already go seen the lectures so i have doubt oh super how uh, what have you seen ajay 7.1 question sir, number activity 7.17 okay sir so what is that consider a student can mentor another student in respect of amount of difference in their marks with this assumption maximum how many ages a student can have so uh, we can't we... saw the question as you uh, yes shown the uh, as you share the notepad not the whole screen okay is that visible now yes sir is, yes sir <clears throat> so ajay uh, yes ha uh, how many days. students uh number of ages we are trying to find now yes so ajay uh, ajay tell me one thing how many participants are there in the uh, meeting no that is no right chance nothing is 61 right. how many 61. participants 61. are there 61 61 61 yeah how many of you uh, listening you uh, listening to you ajay Everyone, oh, 60, no, no, 60, 60, 60, 60, 60. Okay. 60. Okay. Oh, so, 
including you sir n minus 1 people are listening to you correct yes, yes, sir. yes sir so if you can mentor then you are mentoring n minus 1 people yes. okay yes from you in one subject you are mentoring n minus 1 people so how many uh, ages you can have for three subjects Three, three into n minus one, sir. Yeah, three into n minus one. Okay, got it. Is that correct answer? Yes. Yes. It should be correct. Twenty-nine into three. Yes. Yeah. Yes, sir. Seven point two three. Okay, cool. I guess you are done. Next question, please. Seven point two three. Seven point two three. This is what is the default value of elements created in matrix in the mat in the lab. default. अभी तो मैं टोल हूँ अभी तो मैंने बताया वो that is what I am trying to say create n by n ना or it is something else answer is zero zero that is what zero ना create matrix सर ने बताया भी है वीडियो में सर ने बताया है वीडियो में कि वो zero दे रहे हैं that time I am I am not know okay now you know Yes, seven point three five. Create matrix n by n will give you the rows indexes from zero to n minus one, column indexes from zero to n minus one, and every entity is zero. That is another convention which we are following. So there are many conventions. If you solve, if you don't go lecture by lecture, you will really forget one one of them. Okay. Yes. So this computer here, here I also got confused because default value of element starts from zero, right? Zero, one, two, three, four. Yeah. Yeah. So it, the question is not asking like uh, from where it starts like that. Zero is there, one is there here. Empty. Okay. Seven point three five. Seven point three five. Yeah, how many of you like Manchurian? Yeah. What sir? Manchurian. Me, Gobi Manchurian. Maybe we all. Guys, don't eat. No, sir. I haven't we... yet. Manchurian, love... you did not eat. I love Manchurian. क्या बात? Okay. She might be on diet. <laughs> okay. Consider the given graph and answer the following question five and six. Which of the given list represents a click? Uh, as a what is click actually? Undirected graph. Ah. Uh, uh, every element has connection to with the okay, every each other. Elements. Each other. All the nodes are connected to each other. All the nodes are connected. Each and each. every element is connected to the all other elements. All other elements. All are connected. So three, way. one, three, four, five is a click, click, right? Yes. Yes. But two is not click. Two, one, four, two, five three. is a click. Whole graph is a click. Why not, Taja? Because two is not uh, mapping or it five, four and five. Four, four, uh, it's four and five. No, it's connected, but indirect. Indirect. Indirectly connected. It's also no. No. Why are two should be connected to four? Then it will become click. So, ah, uh, we do not know what the connection means in the graph. Okay, until unless it tells, correct? It may yes. be that one is the one is the father of two and three. Is that right? Yes. Father of three. Yes. How yes? Then three. How can three be a father? No, sir. Father? Then it will be a director. Uh... So this this is <laughs> not a relation. Similarity. So might be one and three and uh, are brothers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, brothers. yeah that then might. One be, and two uh, are brothers. That's why two and three are brothers. Yeah. So yes, brothers relation will be one, three, four, five. One, three, four, five. Uh, it might be like uh, uh, what uh, does it follow the uh, brothers relation because two is not being connected. So what is, what could be the relation? One three four five. One three four five are the siblings, okay? But what yes. about two? Two may be the father. Two, two may be the father of four and five. 
or maybe so uh, to maybe father <laughs> <laughs> maybe tell me where does father anything we don't know that's what i'm trying to tell you yes sir so you, you cannot say if one is connected to two then two is connected to four because three is connection between them yeah yeah, yeah. so can in relation we can't say but when uh, click we can say no yeah but in other yes, question yes. we can click yeah so <laughs> because it should be a line we can't make any relation in between maybe here yeah, we can say that the city is connected uh, airports connected wherein we are getting direct flights hmm that in is the uh, correct fair that will give a undirected graph okay most of the time uh, we have bi direction flights no yes sir yes sir yes. is there any flight you know which goes but come back in the same direction or same route i don't think so in covid we see some no covid time there was no yes sir flight yes sir like uh, there may be a uh, direct flight okay so any other question in week sir yes sir activity 7.6 4 and 5 sir sir this one i didn't understand 7.3 I mean, can you one point three? This one five five. Uh, which which of the given this represents a click? So what was the answer that you gave? Ah, uh, click is the where every A is connected to others, na? If I remember correctly. Yes, so so two one is connected to one is connected to three. Yeah. One is connected to three. Three is also connected. So oh, last two the, options are correct. Last two option options last two are one three four five. Wherever one force is involved is not correct. Now, except okay. uh, yeah, except one. fine, fine. Let's see the answer. May I might be forgetting, but I guess I remember. Yes, I I have studied this four uh, or five months back actually. So definitions I might forget. No, the answer that was given is. Oh, Sir, yeah. what is the answer? It it contains a two, no? So first one is the click na. First one is click. Uh, if it has three one. elements only, uh, others are four or five elements, okay. and two is not connected to more than two. Seven point six activity. Same same activity. Fourth question. Can you explain? Ah, uh, fourth question. Consider there are fifteen telemark boats on an island. Is it possible to connect them with wire so? that each telephone booth is connected with exactly five other telephone booths uh this is a different uh, this is a kind of yes. easy question okay so uh, how will you do the connection if everyone is connected to others then how many ss are there can you tell me how sir as i just told that there were 61 participant so every participant is connected with 60 correct yes yes sir so n is connected to if there are n then you can get from 1 n minus 1 connections correct yes sir so there are total connection n into n minus 1 is that right yeah but i am connected to someone that also is connected to me uh, if we draw an edge by in the directed graph then it will be one edge only not two edge Is that right? Yes. So, S means yeah, what? Right. So, n by two. If you do, then uh, you'll get the number of S's. Is that right? Or number of wires in this case? Yes. In this case, fifteen to five by two. Five by two. Oh, what sir? will you give? That is um, give give when that is come integer. That is means uh, the there are connected. So there uh, are three telephones. Okay, suppose there are three telephones: zero, one, two. Okay, 
and zero is connected to one, one is connected to three. How many ages are there? Not arrow, don't see arrow. Three. Three. Okay, how did you get that? Because there are three ages. Three minus one equal to two into three divided by two. Yes. Similarly, let's take four. So you are three. Now connect it with others. How many ages? Six. Is that right? Six. Yes. yes. So two, two has how many connections? How many ages? The remaining three. number of ages. Three. That three. is three. Yeah. So, so four minus one. That is what we are trying to say. Okay. Now, okay. it because there are four, then four minus one into four are connections. But zero to two and two to zero is one only. Because it's, okay, there is only one wire used. Correct. Hmm. 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 Got so it. So we sir. are we are getting twice. So that's why we are dividing by two. So two yeah. is two. Three to the are... six. Six connections. We are counting both from both sides, like uh, two to one and one to two wire as two. Correct. But sir, but you... in but exactly it is only one. Yeah. Sir, can you okay. write it in the matrix and just tell us that? I mean, uh, is it which one is easier, sir? To do to the graph or the matrix? Yeah, matrix is actually not required. So if you say zero, one, two, three, zero. Sorry, we are not here. Zero, one, two, three. So zero, zero, zero. 0, 1, 1, 0 to 2, 1, 0 to 3, 1. Okay. So uh, there are 12 number of 1. Okay. Is yes, that right? Sir. Yeah. Uh, okay. But the connection is what? 0 to 1 and 1 to 1 is same. That's why we are dividing by 2. Oh. So you'll have to count the number of 1s and that divided by 2. two. We are that is, in, hmm. is that we right? are excluding the... Yeah. Hmm. We are excluding the... Uh, bonds which are counted twice. Uh, that's what. So we are totally counting the number of ones. We are dividing that by two. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. It is. Thank you. Uh, any last question? I hope yes, everyone seven point start six, studying four and five. now. Uh, seven point? Six, huh? four and Looks five. Looks like Ajay has gone to... Roti Khongi. Are yaar. Uh, one and two. Uh, nouns within a sentence are always connected to each other. Bro, this is a question which will have uh, from the lecture. So you want me to see the lecture? Yes. Uh, how <laughs> you tell me how nouns are connected? What is taught in lecture? Well, sir. So there is a, uh, it is like whenever we are getting a pronoun, uh, nouns within a sentence are all connected. Within a sentence are all, no. In, the, in this, uh, sir, in this question, the lecture or uh, the example which we have taken, in there it is always connected. So in one sentence, all the nouns are connected. So answer here has to be true. Okay. Okay. Uh, So there was a sentence, if you remember, uh, which said it was a Monday morning. So Monday and there morning, both are connected. Last, at the end of the lecture, professor said that there, there are uh, there are given one assumptions. So that will not work all times. In the lecture, it's true only. Which question actually? As per the lecture, what they discussed in the lecture, it's true. Sandeep, can yes, you tell me true. the question number? 7.6, question number one. one. Question number one. But answer, there are given answer false. Yes, yes, yes. I also checked. I was also having doubt. Even but question I think is they are asking in general or as per the lecture, that, that was the conclusion for me. In the question, there are no writing. They this go uh, this question should be answered as per lecture. the lecture. Yes, it's not mentioned as per the lecture. Yes. Okay. Sorry for the disconnection. Okay. 
uh, you are asking it is for, from the lecture point of view or, or general na no? yes yes yeah. so mostly it is lecture from a point of view mostly from the lecture uh, point of view it should be true no, sir even i did true and i got wrong okay As so what the concept lecture, of connected with true. graph to represent the relationship between different nouns in a paragraph uh, yeah, i you, i really don't want to see that uh, lecture uh, the simple way is telling that rahul and ajay went to tada so is rahul and ajay connected anyway in general it's it, false in general mm, okay. it is see it false but in the lecture the assumptions what uh, we took as per that it's true no there is a basic pronoun concept i guess f e c noun pronoun sure noun yeah, would be connected with the conjunction yeah. I think this question is saying uh, noun to noun direct contact. There is no direct contact in between many verbs and pronouns are there. But if there are conjunction between these two, then they are connected. I think. Noun should be synonyms or always. Okay. I also blindly kept the answer true only after reading the question. <laughs> Irony is uh, in computational thinking we are discussing about English. Yeah. <laughs> so, but we have to make the programming the based on Liliya. English also, no? They are asking if the sorry. Uh, I think they are saying that. Uh, am I audible? Yes. 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 Sir. Yes. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. i think they are trying to say that if uh, two nouns are connected with some word then they are connected i i need to see whole lecture to answer you so better you guys go and this <laughs> no question never be asked in the uh, exam this is just for ex, uh, explain it okay sir so better if someone is there who has gone through the lecture can please explain we all gone through the lecture or everyone is confused sir. with this yeah. question Yes, yeah. we completed. It. It's okay. Let's leave that for a while. Let's. And I believe uh, most of us have made the same mistake. Yes. Of marking it as true. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Me too. Kept true only. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I I marked it false. Because you don't watch the lecture. You watch the video, sir. Right, sir. Okay. What I don't want. Okay, guys. I mean, sir, four uh, and five question. Okay, Ajay is in a rush. Sir, na bag jaye. Four and five. Okay. If you are still there, I will ask the questions. Otherwise, uh, we'll meet again in the next session. Yeah. Uh, before Practice next assignment. week, you will be you will be having some on demand sessions also. Don't worry. Yes, yes, that's what. What is the maximum size? Of... It's okay. It's okay. You can finish, and we'll meet in on-demand session. What is the maximum size of click appeared in the answer of the question number three? Of question number three, we go to maximum size of click. That is what you are asking, Ajay. Yes. Uh, maximum the size of is... click. How can? Yeah, the C option is the correct one. Oh, I see. Your answer is correct one. Yeah. So in that so we can, can we find out maximum size of click. Okay. Click. So yeah. only three. Zero six eleven and zero six twelve and no. No 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 no. Zero eleven six twelve not okay. Three only is that right? Three only. Yeah, it is three. three. So zero to six, zero to five, zero to four. That is one. So which is a combination mm -hmm. of three. Then again, zero to eleven, zero to twelve, and zero to fourteen. That two is three. And then if you connect six to eleven, six to twelve, and six to fourteen, that two is three. So three is the maximum. Hmm. Okay. 
how many cyclic subsides are present in mass of answer of 3 okay uh, how many 1 are you missing sir. something no no 3 only no, there okay sir 3 is not answer Please answer. answer. I don't know, Please sir. Answer, I man. not mark, not see. So now you are. Sir, one doubt okay. is here. You don't, you I, not, just... The fourth question, no. Okay, you, we question? cannot. Uh, we cannot uh, consider zero, six as cyclic. That is zero. Only. Zero. 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 Zero